Best off, he has more. On New Year's Day in the COVID era, a hangover may be the least of your problems, even if you just went to a small gathering the night before. Dr. James Carden with Hartford HealthCare believes while Connecticut has done a pretty good job navigating COVID during the holidays, our state's recently rising 9% positivity rate could go even higher. We anticipate it's going to increase, uh, but we have hope uh, and uh, uh, that we will maintain our ability to meet the demand here. The post-New Year's Eve outlook on COVID in Connecticut is slightly more optimistic from Dr. Michael Urban at the University of New Haven, but not much. I probably would say we either stay at 9%. Uh, hopefully we don't go up higher. Uh, I would love to see it start to go down. Dr. Urban believes enough people kept it low key to keep positivity rates from going up more. The ones we spoke with at Stanley Quarter Park in New Britain sounded like they played it safe. We just stay home with my family. We make a nice chicken soup, stay home, put my daughter to sleep early and, you know, spend my time with my wife. We went early to dinner somewhere and we were the only people in the restaurant. So, you know, I think a lot of people just decided to stay home yesterday. So hopefully that'll help. With all the holiday gatherings and the COVID risks they present pretty much out of the way now, people are just hopeful that vaccines and vigilance will get Connecticut's COVID positivity rate going in the right direction. In New Britain, Len Bestoff, NBC Connecticut News.